You'd think the solution to poverty is more aid or greater charitable giving, but those are only short-term stopgap solutions. If you care about the poor, then you're going to seek out ways to create new economic opportunities for them. My name's Chris. I'm an entrepreneur and a toy maker. Let me tell you my story. We started a toy business and we hit upon an idea to use a for-profit business that would be dynamic and that would generate more and more jobs as it grew. Tegu is a toy company. We make magnetic wooden building blocks. We sell them throughout the world. It adds the magic of having a magnet inside of them and you can just build whatever you want. Started the factory, we hired about 12 people to start with. By 2010, that was 50. Now we employ almost 90 people at the factory. Many of our employees now are financially well. They are growing economically. Their levels of income are coming up. Their standard of living is coming up. They're able to fund high quality education for their kids. They're able to get access to health care. They can dream and actually make their dreams a reality. Y yo comienzo a ver un nuevo futuro. Yo comienzo a ver a mi hijo crecer. Comienzo a ver mi familia prosperar. Eh, miro mi familia como más alegre. Ahorita casualmente los, está, los van a dar un, una capacitación y para mí es un beneficio porque voy a crecer como persona, voy a crecer para poderle dar una mejor educación a mis hijas. That's what you need to see in the, in the entire economy. You know, we're one small microcosm here at Tegu, but we need to see tens, if not hundreds of other companies like us. And as a result, the society that that economy represents benefits in the process. Better literacy, right? Better health care. It means that I will care more about the environment and not pollute. And that's how a whole society benefits through entrepreneurship and economic growth on a small scale that becomes bigger and bigger and bigger. And so it multiplies into other towns, not just one, two towns, but 10, 20, 30, and just expanding throughout the entire nation. That's the impact of what we're doing, and that's economic growth. You can make charitable contributions to a person's well being today and they will have a short-term impact on their life. But if that's not fueled by a for-profit engine, it's, it's naturally going to be short-lived. What about tomorrow? What about the next generation that's coming from them? You want to care about the poor. It is a moral issue. You need economic growth. What we really need to address issues of poverty is economic growth through for-profit mechanisms that create sustainable opportunities for people. How can this person earn a gainful living? Now suddenly that person's on a trajectory towards prosperity, and that's transformational.